Hello and welcome to this tutorial on how to install Kali Linux Purple or Violet on VirtualBox. In this video, I will show you step by step how to install the new machine so you can start using its powerful ethical hacking tools. The first step is to download the Kali Purple ISO image from the official website. Go to www.kali.org. Then click on Download. Next, select the version of Kali Linux you want to download. I will download the latest version, KaliPurple.iso. Once the download is complete, you should have a .iso file on your computer. The second step is to create a new virtual machine. Once you have launched VirtualBox, open it and click on the new button to create a new virtual machine. Give your virtual machine a name, for example, Kali Purple. In this step, you will add the Kali Purple ISO image that you downloaded in the first step and select Linux as the type and Debian 64-bit as the version. You will need to configure the settings of your virtual machine. You can set the amount of RAM and the size of the allocated hard disk for your virtual machine. Now that you have configured the settings of your virtual machine and added the Kali Purple ISO image, you can install Kali Linux Purple on VirtualBox. Click on Start to boot the virtual machine. When the virtual machine starts, you will see the Kali Purple boot screen. Select Install to start the installation process. Choose the language you want to use during the installation and click on Continue. Select your geographic location and click on Continue. Choose your keyboard layout and click on Continue. Configure your network. If you are using NAT network access mode, most settings will be automatically detected. If you are using bridged network or other network modes, you may need to manually configure the settings. Click on Continue when you are done. Enter a name for your computer and a username for the main account of Kali Purple. You can also set a password for this account. Click on Continue when you are done. Kali Purple is an open source platform for computer security. It is an evolution of Kali Linux and Backtrack, which made offensive security accessible to everyone. Kali Purple aims to make defensive security accessible to everyone without the need for expensive licenses or commercial grade infrastructure. Select the entire disk to install Kali Purple. Click on Continue to proceed. Choose the type of installation you want to perform. If you are new to Kali Purple, we recommend choosing the guided use entire disk option. This will erase everything on the virtual hard disk and install Kali Purple in its place. Click on continue when you are done. Confirm that you want to install Kali Purple by clicking on install now. The installation process of Kali Purple will begin and may take between 5 to 10 minutes to complete, depending on the performance of your computer. Please wait until the installation process is fully finished. Speaking of this machine, Kali Purple is equipped with a wide range of defensive security tools that allow you to test and assess the security of computer systems and networks. 
It also offers features for security management, network activity monitoring, vulnerability protection, threat detection, and security incident response. Kali Purple is designed to be user-friendly, even for beginners in computer security. The platform is regularly updated to include the latest security updates and new features. In summary, Kali Purple is a powerful, accessible, and open-source computer security platform that offers a comprehensive range of tools and features to enhance the security of computer system and networks. Returning to the installation. Grub, Grand Unified Bootloader, is an important step when installing Kali Purple or any other Linux-based operating system. Grub is a program that is installed on your computer's hard drive and is loaded when you start your computer. It is responsible for loading the Linux kernel and initiating the boot process of the operating system. Once the installation is complete, you will need to restart the virtual machine. Click on Continue to restart the virtual machine. When the virtual machine restarts, you should see the Kali Purple login screen. Enter your username and password to log in. We hope you enjoyed our videos. To support us and keep us going, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for your attention and see you soon.